just looking for somewhere a bit shady where I can pull over and uh, give you a quick demo of how to change the rear suspension to lower it a little bit. Right, so I found somewhere relatively quiet, relatively shady. Let's do this before it gets too hot. Wait for the car to go past. Right, so I'm going to show you quickly how to change the mode so you've got a lower suspension on the back for paddling around at uh, slow speed or perhaps in towns, whatever. It just makes it a little bit easier. So I will demonstrate first of all. Right, so whilst the engine is running, select the home button on the right hand bar. Now using the toggle switch below the indicator on the left hand bar, go to riding modes. Now you can do this as by choosing off-road, but you have to be at standstill to change it uh, back. So it, it's better to use the way I'm going to show you, which is the rider mode, where you can select what you want under your own pre-selected rider settings. And we go down to map, make sure you've chosen off-road, as I have got here, and that's ticked go back to this rider stage and go down to traction control and ensure that that has been switched on because the off-road default is traction control off and also ABS make sure you go into that and put it into road mode so that it's switched on and that should do it so now to select it, so I'm currently in the road mode here at the top. So by using the menu button on the left hand handlebar, press that to bring up these icons down here and now scroll across to the rider mode with the helmet, select that and you'll notice that the adjustment is in progress and it's actually lowering the bike at the moment. I'll try and film that separately so you can see. You may not be able to determine it, but it has. So instead of being on a sort of tippy toes, I'm not flat footed, but it's a lot better. And it's now selected that as my rider mode. So I go through that again, choose the menu button, go across to where I normally have it in sporty, curvy road, select that. And now it's going to push the, the uh, adjust it's now going to adjust the suspension up on the back to give it more preload. Does that make sense? Sticking gear always helps. Left hand side of the road. Village of Eden, this is E-Y-D-O-N. So I found it useful anyway, as I say, for uh, paddling around, moving it out of the garage, or around town, something like that. I would hasten to warn you I've tried riding it in that mode because I thought well it's not that much lower but it does make things easier why don't I just leave it in that mode all the time but of course it does alter the geometry and I found that it understeered quite considerably I guess you get used to that and you'd compensate but um, having always ridden mine in the windy roads mode I must put it back into actually. Yes, I wouldn't leave it in that mode all the time to be fair, unless you're just going to get used to that understeery feeling and compensate for it, but uh, I didn't like the uh, the feel of it to be honest myself. But jolly useful if you're you know, he heading into home and you know you're going to have a paddle around with a garage or you're heading into a town, just dribbling through a town and you know you're going to have to sort of park up or there's going to be loads of traffic lights and you're looking for a hotel for the night then could be useful just to stick it in there it just gives you extra gives you that extra purchase with your feet if you're having to move it around anyway that's just a quick vlog short vlog i hope you found it useful if you did please give it a thumbs up it all helps with the old analytics with youtube cheers now see you next time